see here is the query to find the missing numbers so i will show you the two methods first of all okay so why because uh, i mean to say that i, I want to explain you that uh, if the range can be changed okay for that reason okay. i like to i like to share you with two methods okay simple method not that that much big simple method yes sir so okay first normal method i will show you again later i will show you the another method okay okay first of all what you will do row of indirect starting with 1 ampersand max you have to take the maximum number from here we don't know what is the maximum number actually it may be anything, yes. but but we have to pick up first two maximum number that is see it will it will come like this from starting oh, 1 nice. to 15 now what we have to do means match those things with this comma zero right it's an array uh, array function okay. if i press if if i press f9 it will show you the number other than if it is not found it will show you the na okay. the position first of all it will pick up the positions the way where one is there where two is there where 11 is there i would say 3 1 2 3 the positions match will always pick up the positions so it will pick up the positions position okay. of the row number yes see here three yes sir yes sir three two and uh, one two three three in the eleventh position see eleven yes, sir okay yeah. now what i'll do just i'll copy the uh, copy this control c now i want i want errors okay if error if you sorry error type mm -hmm. is error okay if is error anything over here then give me which i copied just now okay understanding yes sir yes sir understand so it will it will show you the numbers which are not for uh, which are not in a range are you able to see that number uh, yes sir yes sir so now what you have to do you have to yes sir. you have to bring it out so what i'll do the small function will help us to bring that one out if i type one it will pick up the first number that is 10 if i type two it will pick up the second smallest number Okay. okay so so what i'll do as rows rows of f dollar 3 colon f3 okay it's an array function yes sir yes control sir. shift and so enter. okay and yeah. okay okay sir. and another method see here we are yes, blind sir. we are blindly we can say here it is a one start with the one but in some uh, in some ranges it may give the wrong wrong range like that uh, starts with 8 and find uh, till 20 you have to find from 8 yes, to sir. 20 which number which number is missing yes sir yes sir okay for that reason what you have to do means the say i'll copy the same formula control c wait a minute f2 i'll copy the same formula control c escape f2 control v here what i'll do here what it is taking okay what it may be it will uh, here in place of 1 okay. we will okay. use min yes min like this row of indirect of min of this range f4 
ampersand colon colon ampersand max sorry now max they want so better use this is the better thing because whenever you type one it it is not it is not a proper thing okay it may yes, be sir, yes, sir. eight it, it yeah. may be start with seven six five we doesn't know yes sir. so this is the this is the proper yeah, way it, to extract it yes sir. in any case if uh, smallest number is 10 and uh, uh, maximum number is 20 then yeah. one will not work yes yes, yes. this will work automatically yes, yes, yes. everywhere it will work yes sir okay sir understand now how you will pick up the missing number from here yes. now tell me how you pick up this number from here sir okay i'll start which one, one sir which one 5 uh, 6 ah uh, yes 1 2 randomly i'm giving number which is uh, which is not duplicates okay mm -hmm, mine okay simply mm, no no you tell me some numbers in the cell which is not duplicate numbers something and whatever it may be 7 8 9 7 8 9 7 8 9 2 it's enough 5 4 so it will not so it will not work because 10 is there so it will it will think 10 okay so better use this way 7 comma 5 comma 4 comma 3 comma Eight. Now find the missing number from here. Okay, it will work. Done. Okay. Yes, it now it will work. See, you have to extract numbers like this in okay. a row wise. Okay, not a column wise. Let me know which number is missing from here, and tomorrow I'll try to take a video class. If it is there, okay, I'll just leave it off. But by tomorrow evening, okay. you have to solve it. Okay, sir. Hmm. Like okay, you. Sir, okay. okay. In the group also, in the group also, I will send this thing. Let's see who will solve it. Okay. 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 Okay, okay. then. B bye, guys. Hi friends, this is Amaya's Guru, and here is the Amaya's Challenge 15. So here is the query you have to observe that. First of all, I'll explain about this query. What is it, what this query about? See. Hello. You have to find the. First of all, you have to find the fifth two. There are so many. Two digits are there. You have to find the fifth digit, the two with characters. See, here is the here is the two. So it considers as a one. It considers as a two. Three, four, and five. So this will be the output you have to get. This L. Output you have to get as per the condition. That is, you have to find first of all. You have to find fifth two. Right. Let's begin the topic now. See what I'm doing. First of all, I have to find how many twos are there. Right. So what I'll do, I'll select all those things equal to two. This is the first condition, and the second condition is. You have to find the positions of the characters. You have to find the positions of the characters. Okay. If you directly do, it will pick up all the special characters. But we want only to find the alphabets. Okay. You have to find the alphabets only. So this is the query. This is the solution which I am going to show you. Observe clearly. 
that is first of all match of f2 this whole thing okay still where where it is okay control backspace this is the match lookup value now we have to find the what you want to find you want to find the positions of the characters so you have to use one condition that is care of row of indirect no 65 and percent 90 so it will pick up the positions okay comma zero so it will pick up the positions where it occurs right right so here is the thing we have to follow still here i will highlight and i press f9 see here is the position so there wherever wherever the character is there it will pick up that position and it will show us that numbers right in third position see here 23 here 